Hey everyone, it's Andy Zitzman, founder of the Game Time Movement, where I'm on a mission to helping you and one million other people step up your game. In this short three to five minutes every day, I'm going to provide you with inspiration, motivation, and empowering information so that you can wake up, have a little pick-me-up, get fired up so that you step up on a daily basis. So get ready, because it's time, it's your time, it's game time. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Andy Zitzman and welcome to today's show. Today, we are going to ignite. That's right. We are about to ignite today. So check it out. My friend, my dear friend and colleague, Dr. Kim Carter. I want you to go check her out. You can go to www.drkimcarter.com and you can find her on Facebook as well, Dr. Kim Carter. And I'll put it in the show notes. I'll put it in the email I send out. But I want you to go check out Dr. Kim Carter because she is the igniter doctor. And I am fired up because the other night she did a speech that just moved me and spoke to me. And so I want to share it with you because it's a message that we all need. You see, Dr. Kim Carter realized at a point in life, she got to a point where, you know, she wasn't living ignited. She lived most of her life ignited. But she got to a point where she got sick and she went to the doctors and she had a lung mass. And she had to make a decision at that point whether she was going to, you know, wallow in her sorrow and give up and just realize that, oh no, maybe I have cancer and just let it go. Or she was going to take this opportunity to wake up, to start living again and to ignite her path. And so from that moment on, Dr. Carter has been doing just that, not only igniting her path, but helping other people ignite theirs. And so the other night she shared a message that was just so, so powerful. And the message was called Ignite your life. So if you're sitting here right now, ask yourself the question, are you living a life on fire? Is your life ignited each and every day? Are you living with that passion, with that energy, with that enthusiasm that you know you can live with? Or are you just kind of getting by? Or maybe you're down in the dumps and you're just struggling to get out of it. Wherever you are, just know this, that's about how long it takes to ignite your path. So today, I'm gonna ask you to do your best to ignite your path. As Dr. Kim Carter would say, ignite your life. And here's how you do it. Here's how you do it. If you follow three simple steps, you can ignite your path. And in fact, if you wanna follow a few more steps, go to Dr. Kim Carter's website, drkimcarter.com, and download her free ebook, which is called Ignition Points. She'll walk you through a variety of different ways to ignite your path each and every day. But the simple way in what she shares are three points, three steps. And those steps are focus, fuel, fight. Focus, fuel, fight. In fact, I made a little poem for it. Focus, fuel, fight until you get it right. Focus, fuel, fight until you get it right. This is your life. It's time to ignite. And so here's how you do it. You focus on your inner flame. That's right. Number one, focus on your inner flame. That's your why. We talked about finding your why. So focus on your inner flame. Find your why. Why is it that you should live an ignited life? Is it because of your daughter, your son, your wife? Is it because, you know, perhaps you just want to make more money? Is it perhaps you want to get out of debt? Is it perhaps that you just want to get healthy? But find that why and go deep, deep into your soul, into your heart, and find the reasons why you want to live an ignited life. And when you get those down and you remind yourself of those whys each and every day, that is going to push you through. That is going to ignite you each and every day. But you got to bring it to the forefront of the consciousness. That's right. You You've got to remind yourself why you're doing what you're doing. And you've got to remind yourself and have powerful, compelling reasons why. So focus on your inner flame. Get clear on that. And once you do, go to number two, which is fuel it. That's right. Fuel that flame. Listen, you know, we talked about motivation being a sh- like a shower, right? Each and every day you take a shower where each and every day you got to get yourself fired up and motivated. You got to fuel it. That's right. And so how do you fuel that flame? Well, you can read. You can watch a podcast like this. You can go watch videos on YouTube. 
You can go and invest in yourself like, like Kim and I have, you know, and hire a speaking coach, hire a business coach, hire a life coach. You know, you, if, you, if you don't want to hire someone, go find a mentor. Go find people that have what you want, model them, hang out with them, ask them to mentor and lead you. Go to networking events, go to seminars, go to workshops. You know, I mean, there are so many things you can do to fuel your flame, but the best way to fuel your flame is just to invest in you. That's right. And make sure as you're investing in you, you're also investing in communities that will invest in you to push you forward and fuel your flame. You got to pay attention to who you're listening to, who you're hanging out with, what you're watching and what you're doing. If that stuff fuels your flame, keep doing it. If it's not and it's getting in the way, you got to let it go. It's as simple as that. So you focus on your inner flame, you get that why, you get going, and then you gotta fuel it each and every day. I mean, it's like it's like when you throw wood into a fire, right? It fuels it, it flames it, it gets bigger and bigger. That's what you gotta do in your life. That's what you gotta do in your business. You gotta fuel that flame. Number two. So number three, once you focus and once you find that inner flame, once you fuel that flame, I'll tell you this, no matter how much fuel you put on it, you're gonna have to fight. That's right, you're gonna have to Fight, fight for that flame, to keep that flame alive. You know, I'm telling you right now, I'm growing my business right now. And I, I found out my why years ago and I worked on it. Then I fueled that flame. I got the skills, the knowledge, certified in coaching, started a business, started a podcast. And you know, I still wasn't there yet though. It takes time to build greatness in the championship. It takes time. And so, you know, as that time goes on, you're going to have ups and downs and struggles and things all around you that get in the way. You're going to make mistakes. You're going to have failures, but you got to pick yourself back up and you got to fight because nothing great in life comes without a little bit of a fight. So you got to fight for your flame because once you get that flame going, once you start fueling it and gets bigger and bigger, you got to fight to keep it going. You can never let it die. And so that's what Dr. Kim shared with us. Focus, fuel, fight until you get it right. This is your life. It's time. You know it's your time to ignite. It's game time. Hey, thanks for tuning in today, and thanks for stepping up your game. Here's what you can do to spread the movement. Go to GameTimeMovement.com and be sure to share your Game Time Moment of the Day, your GMOTD, so that others will feel compelled to share their Game Time Moments too. And if you haven't already, subscribe on iTunes or Stitcher Radio, and please be so kind to leave a rating and review so that we can reach 1 million people and encourage them to step up their game too. This is Andy Zitzman reminding you, it's your time, it's game time, till next time.